such a fun experiment. I don't normally do instructional videos or cooking videos, so bear with me. You're gonna need a couple of things to get started. Calcium lactate and sodium alginate. I did get this brand sodium alginate, but I couldn't get it to work, so I went with this and it worked the first time. Silicone molds, all of these are linked if you go to my profile. You can use any silicone mold you want. I personally like these ones because they're smaller for my kids. You're gonna need a bowl that can be covered, kitchen scale to get exact measurements, distilled water, and a beverage of your choice. I'm gonna link the creator whose TikTok I came across and gave me this idea. One of her videos, she used edible glitter. I'll link this eight pack below for you. I'm gonna take a thousand milliliters of distilled water. This is where you're going to want your kitchen scale because you need exactly five grams of the sodium alginate. Take your immersion blender or regular blender and mix it up. You want a thick white consistency, otherwise it's not gonna work. Cover it up and put it in the fridge until all the air bubbles are gone and the liquid is clear. Then on to whatever you want inside your pot. For this step, it really depends on how much you're making. You just want 2% of the weight of your beverage. You make 100 grams of a beverage, you want two grams of your calcium lactate. This is what 100 grams of your drink looks like, so it's not very much. I did 200 grams of juice, so I'm gonna do four grams of the calcium lactate. Since this one's for my kids, I'm gonna use edible glitter. Then just mix it up. You see the glitter in there? I'm gonna fill up your mold and freeze them. Cut to the next day. You can see this is nice and clear, so now we're gonna warm it up to about 125 degrees. While my solution's warming up in the microwave, I got two little bowls of water that you're gonna rinse off your pods in. Grab your ice cubes and drop them in. I found that only doing two or three at a time works best so they don't get stuck together and then they'll pop when you pull them out. Once they're all melted, you simply just do bath number one, bath number two, and now you got your pods. These are the ones that have the edible glitter and regular juice so my kids can have them.